Um, this is Shola Olojede, and welcome to my um, channel once again. And um, in today's um, training, I'll call it a tutorial, actually. I'll be sharing with you today um, just an advanced underground tutorial module one. And uh, this is all about it's a form of ninja stuff that we affiliate are using these days to crush it in the market. I'm not supposed to be revealing this, but I just thought that this are opportunity for me to reveal something like this to people, to help other people out who have been struggling out there and uh, to smash it in terms of um, car, um, making money online. So um, with that being said, let's jump in as quick as possible. So what I'll be going through for the next few days is actually, this is an advanced um, underground training. You can never get this anywhere else. And I'll be doing this over the next, um, they'll be coming up in the, in the form of three modules. This is actually module one. And I would like you to watch the rest of the modules because this is the only way it will help you to make money. So with that being said, the first thing I was first of all want to ask you is you must have, if you have a Gmail account, then quickly sign up for what is called the Google AdWords. So you have a Gmail account, sign up for Google AdWords. And once you sign up for Google AdWords, you should be able to come to um, a website platform, a platform like this, showing I've just got into my platform and um, it's not something that is too hard. Just launch your Google AdWords, get to um, a page like this, find yourself to be in a page like this. And that's this where it all starts. And um, what I'm about to share with you today is about running um, product launches. We call it launch jacking. You see, there are some product launches that if it's more than three days, then does it. You can't really make money out of it. But I want to let you teach you how half of it out there, how we make money out there, even though the product is being launched newly, you can quickly be part of people who make money from this new product that has just been launched. So with that being said, we'll be going into it right now. So you've joined, once you sign up to Google AdWords, all I just want you to do is you need to go into new campaign. That says you'll be creating a new campaign for yourself. All you just need to go is, um, let me try and move this over here so that you'll be able to see more, more information. Okay, fantastic. So um, what I just want to also let you know that all you want to go is, you want to go into what we call product and brand consideration. As if I've seen it now, I've clicked on product and brand consideration. That's the first thing you click on. Then you go into what we call um, video. Do not click on display. On another form of video, I will be teaching you something on how to use this display. But for today, we'll be risk, we'll, I'll be restricting the training module only on video. All you just need to do now is click on video. And you want to click on influence consideration forget about ad sequence forget about shopping you know all these are newly in the market click on influence consideration click on continue and uh, that will surely just hold on for the few minutes for that to pop up it's just generating and um getting setting up some few things up which you'll see very soon so once you, you've seen the process I've, I've followed there, you go into your product and brand consideration. After your product and brand, brand consideration, you go into what I call um, 
had you click on video after video then you click on influence consideration what influence consideration is all about is that it's going to influence this is a form of influencing people on how um you're going to influence people to buy your product whatever product you're promoting this is how you're going to influence it so now let's crack on the first thing you want to do is video campaign so you want to choose it you can this is video consideration as you said you can put it okay what product are you promoting it could be an affiliate product let's take for example we are promoting a product called affiliate affiliate pro affiliate pro let's take for example affiliate pro and all you want to do leave the maximum cpv leave it the way it is and i would advise you to stick to a budget of roughly 15 pounds or 20 pound daily so change your campaign total to daily so this will actually help you so that because as once you set this up you see you'll be going under reviewed google uh, the google team guys once you finish setting up you'll be going under review and uh, for them to review this quickly as soon as possible for you i would advise you just to go immediately in um enter a budget type and amount of 15 um for you guys that are in the um, us 15 dollars i'm presently in the uk at the moment so um you choose 15 pounds so when you look at the impression is giving us here is giving us impression of 2 billion people and uh, that's not what people who will be actually targeting you want to choose your okay start date now you need to edit it so now this is one thing i want to really talk about your start date this is an affiliate product if this is a product that is just newly launched, it's about to launch, you give it, let's say, you need to make sure that you are ready with your pre-sale lander, or we call it squeeze page, or it could be a bonus page, whatever you really want to call it. One of all these things, you make sure all these are ready. I'll be going through this with you in the last module so that you have a real understanding of what I really meant by pre-sale lander, um, squeeze, squeeze pages, and um, bonus pages, bonus delivery pages. You get to understand what I mean by that. So now you want to select the date. And for any product that is just newly launched, Let's say, for example, today um, is um, 17. You want to choose your start date to start from 17. And you want to choose the end date as well. Don't forget, it has to be three days. You're choosing one, two, three. So as a, you want to choose 19. So that should start on the 17. And it should run through till 19. For example, I was also, let's give it um, an extra day of one more day, let's say on, on the 20. And once you're done, you want to look at your delivery method. This is very important. Now, this is an a newly product. This is especially, this is an ads setup, campaign setup for launch jacking. Forget about if it's an evergreen product, you tend to stick with what we call standard recommended, which is this. But now you are, you'll be, um, because it's a launch jack product that is newly launched product. I know launch jack products for you to make real good money. The first money within when they first launch a product is end within the first three days so i want you to put this into consideration so because of this we've chosen our set time start time start date and we've also chosen our end date so we also now have to choose our delivery method as accelerated now you will want to ask 
What is the reason for this? Now it has given us use standard delivery with the daily budget type. Otherwise, your campaign might experience decrease in cost efficiency. We want that. That's what we want. The reason for accelerated is we want Google to spend our money immediately to reach out to to blast out to reach as many audiences out there immediately you know once you're standard recommended then you google will now choose when when which bucket to put you on which cycle is going to apportion your ads all throughout the day. But once you've chosen accelerated, it's going to apportion all your ad immediately. This will go into accelerated, and this is what we want because we want, we're looking into a space of from the um, a space of three days, and that's it done. And you want to get all the money you need to make. You understand? So please really put this into consideration. Very, very important. Now, the network. You need now to now click on the network. One thing I also advise you now, on click on video partners on display network and leave YouTube search results and YouTube videos. Reason for this is because you don't want to waste your money. You don't want Google to just um, burn out of your daily spend unnecessarily without getting any form of ROA, you return on your capital invested. So that's the reason this will just be, these ads will just be placed on anybody's website and this will not generate enough traffic for you. Now, the next bit you want to go into is the language. I will advise you not to choose all languages. I will advise you go into, um, Choose, select your own date, um, language. Select the language that you want, and that's actually English. If you are in um, other country that speak different language, then look for the country in which you're marketing. Actually, I normally market the, um, I will explain, I will try to let you know the locations I do really target. And so they are all English speaking um, countries. So once you're done with that, you make sure you, you click on English. And once that is done, you click on the location. The location is very, very important as well. So now I choose, um, first six countries. And these are, these are English speaking countries. And these countries, they are meant, I'll tell you that they are really meant to convert. This, this, these are the countries I do target. Number one, I choose, you choose, enter, enter another location, United Kingdom, definitely where I reside. You choose United Kingdom. You also choose United States. You choose United Kingdom. You choose United, we target United States. We target United Kingdom. We target um, Australia. We target um, Australia. We target New Zealand. We target South Africa. We target Iceland. Um, Ireland. That's another country we do target. I've chosen United States. Yeah, United Kingdom. Um, Canada is another very good one. They also do convert very well. So that's another thing you just bear in mind. You choose Canada. That's really, really um, also is another very top country in which um, I do get um, good conversion from in terms of traffic. So um, I think I've chosen, I don't want to waste too much of your time. I normally choose up to six, Canada, United Kingdom, Australia, New Zealand, and uh, probably Ireland, and I also hired. Sometimes I could get, I do get some good conversion in South Africa, which is also something that is um, fantastic. Australia, so um, we target Australia. And um, with that being said, I don't want to waste too much of your time on that. You can see I've already accepted taking for there. We've targeted for now. You now go into your inventory type. 
when you look at it, your inventory tribe is go into your inventory, just choose standard inventory. Fantastic. That means show ads on content that's appropriate for most brands, which is fantastic. Just leave that the way it is. You don't need to waste your time on that. Then you now you don't need to exclude anything. You are fine with any form of traffic. So now you now go into additional setting. So your additional setting now goes into definitely you want to go for all devices. The reason is you are just newly setting up because let me tell you, if you are someone who is just running YouTube ad, select all devices. As for me now, I've already, I know how to retarget. I know which um, defi devices to, to target where I will get high conversion. But as you are just starting, for example, I would advise you to stay with all eligible devices. From there, once you've got enough data, you are you can you want to really now start scaling. You've got which I'll be going through with you in module three. I'll tell you how to retarget, how to remarket, how to also set up your remarketing so that you can remarket all other ads. So after that, you go your frequencies, another very, very important frequency capping, very, very important. I would advise you in this kind of situation, frequency capping, you want to show your ads seven times, no more than seven times per day. Very, very important because this is going to be running through three days. So you want it to show to as much as possible to people because let me tell you, if people see your hard ones, they see it the second time, sometimes they only take action at the seventh, it has been tested, researched that people take action after they've seen your ads for more than up to six to seven times. They tend to, okay, look at it. Let, let me give this a try. And they, they develop that interest. And before you know it, and you get them to convert. So now you also look at this. You also choose your calm. You choose also this as seven, seven per day. And that you leave it the way it is, you cap it, because what this means is that the same person, you can still, they can, the impression can be viewed seven times, and that's it. Once it's viewed seven times, then that's it. You don't want any other, the same person to still view your ads. So that will help you also to manage your cost. So what do you want hard scheduled all day? You want that. Then this is where we now go into our ad group. Your ad group, what do you now name it? You can give your ad group, you can choose a name. As I said, you can just choose in affiliates, affiliates pro, as we've said, um, ads, ad group. AG, you can choose what you've targeted. You can choose that we've targeted all countries, six country. This is all just for you to know if you do run many ads like me, you put in six countries or six locations, six E, that means the six English countries. You can put it that way. Then what people, now this is, this is where I'll be going through with you tomorrow. What people means, what demography means, what audience for now, I wouldn't want to touch into any of this, but tomorrow I'll be going through with you what I normally use, which is keywords. I use the products, I'll be promoting keywords and some related keywords that will help me. Let's take, for example, Aflex Pro. I'm going to use the keyword like Aflex Pro Review, Aflex Pro Review and Bonuses, Aflex Pro um, Bonuses and Reviews, Aflex Pro, different kind. Then I will use um, the Google planner google keyword planner too also to get some ideas so with that being said i wouldn't want to take too much of your time we'll go in detail in this in the model too where i will uh, explain more of what this is all about then the next bit of this now is that we now choose what we call 
we will now look at our maximum bidding. Our maximum bidding. I wouldn't want us to go more than I normally go. I don't go for more than fifty cent. Let me tell you, your it will be still less. YouTube ads is quite less, um, less in terms of spends. Is in, in terms of cost per view. Right? When you, especially when you, it's not like Facebook where you spend up to a dollar for just a view. So YouTube, as I've put sixty pay, um, sixty there, um, is it will the cent will still it, it could be a pen, it could be five cent, it could be eleven. I'm just putting this there just for it to um understand what I'm trying to um just put it as the cost per view bid. This is what I really am really targeting so that I'll be able to compete with anybody out there in in who are also promoting the same product. So now the final, where we'll be going to now, we now choose the YouTube video. This is very, very important. So let's take, for example, I now need to have, and I need now go into my YouTube video. I will need to quickly sign into my YouTube video and put, and just click on any, let's take, for example, let's go into any, I wouldn't go into my YouTube video now because I'm not set up. Yeah, let's go into YouTube. From here, we just, for example, all you just want to do here, this, I would advise you to use your own URL. The URL of the um, review video you have actually um, really processed. So once that is done, just make sure, make use of the URL and um, let's take, for example, I think it's almost there. Just pick, for example, for an example, I'll just pick an a URL. Let's take, for example, I'll be picking one of this product in here so that we we don't not waste too much of my time and your time. We just pick one of the URL and you place your URL in here. And once you're done, once you're done with that, all you just need to click is save and continue. So I hope me running through with this, these are little hacks people do not know out there. You, they do not understand how people are making, running, making this money online or making this money on in good commissions of running affiliate product. This is one of the secrets I've just revealed to you. So I will really want you to make use of these and I don't want to take too much of your time because I think this video is really now going too long. And tomorrow I'll be going into the um, advanced underground tutorial module two, where I'm going to share with you how to make use of audience, topics, keywords, and how to use that, and what was meant by what we call um, custom intent, in-market intent, um, in-market intent. There is a lot of things now which we have now at our hands to use, a lot of tools to use now to make you to easily land your commission as quick as possible to get that buyer that really want to purchase your products. So with that being said, I will not want to take too much of your time. And one thing I would like to let you know is that if you feel you really want to learn more on this, I would like you to subscribe to my YouTube channel, click the notification bell to make sure you get notified as I'll be sharing a lot of secrets, a lot of, I'll be revealing a lot of ninja stuff used by we athletes that people will not be happy that I'm sharing this, but I've got to share it because I learned it, although I spent a lot of money learning all these kind of secrets, but I don't believe, I believe a way of helping people out who have been struggling to get out of their nine to five job they want to be on their own start running their own business this is one of the best way to do that so thank you very much for watching this and i'll see you on my next 
review um, module tutorial two. Thank you.